Alright guys, what's going on? This is your Angry Birds NASCAR fan, Jimmy48 fan here, and welcome to the first ever Jimmy48 vlog of 2019. Yes guys, I know it's a new name for the vlogs, but you know, I had to go through, you know, if you guys didn't know, I changed my name to Jimmy48 fan, um, just, uh, you know, new, new car and all that, so I kinda had to follow suit on that, but... Anyway, vlogs are still happening, this vlog, uh, new name for the vlogs, and uh, hope you guys are really excited for this one, uh, because today, on this vlog, um, I'm going to be taking you guys to Oaks, Pennsylvania for the Motorsports Race Car and Trade Show. Now, nobody has ever vlogged from there, so I'm going to be the first person to actually vlog from this event. Uh, um... Uh, well, actually, right now as I'm recording this, it's Friday night. As, um, as a matter of fact, you're wondering why I got the headset on right now, about to turn on the mic. reason why is that because we're about to go live on the Core League. If you guys don't know, um, I'm the official commentator for the, for, for the Core Racing League, uh, that happens, uh, every Friday, every Friday night, uh, throughout this, throughout the season. Uh, as a matter of fact, we're about to do... Race number seven tonight, which is at Auto Club Speedway, um, which means after this we will only have um, we will only have five more race we will only have five more races left in the season. Um, it's really really close battle between uh, Dale Reynolds, Ed Sound, Ed Soundhead. Those are the main two guys up ahead. Uh, Sloppy Joe's also up there. So a lot a lot can a lot can happen in these next five races. And uh, if you guys don't already know, obviously you just like I said, I am the official core commentator. So um, so yeah, um, in a little bit, I'm about to be I'm about to be going live um, on the on the core channel. Um, so yeah, that's how we got. So yeah, that's uh, I'm officially starting the vlog off this way. Um, but anyway, uh, tomorrow, um, tomorrow morning, we're gonna be heading out to Oaks, Pennsylvania, uh, to the Greater Philadelphia Expo Center. So uh, so yeah, it's gonna be a very fun vlog uh, here on this channel. Um, you're gonna be seeing few drivers you'll be seeing a few race teams uh you're gonna be seeing a lot a lot of people that you're um a lot of a lot of a lot of faces that you're probably all familiar with and um also um i'm also meeting some of my friends over there as well as some pretty popular youtubers so so definitely stay tuned for that but anyway um i'm about to broadcast and i'll see you guys in a little bit all right so we just so i just finished up the uh the core broadcast uh from Auto Club, I it was a real, it was a really exciting, really exciting race uh, tonight. Brennan Littell ended up winning. Uh, by the way, he follows me on he follows me on Instagram, and uh, he also subscribed to the channel. So Brennan, if you are watching this, uh, I'm very proud of you tonight. Um, you did you did a fantastic job out there. You played the strategy just right. You did absolutely deserve this win. And uh, um, once again, I'm very proud of you, man. And I hope uh, hope the rest of the season will go well for you. But um, anyway, um. Now that that's out of the way, um, I'm gonna since uh, my Carnation Cup race is uh, tomorrow. Since uh, since my Carnation Cup race is tomorrow night, um, uh, I might as well do some practice sessions right now. So um, I'll show you guys. Uh, I'll show you guys uh, one of my quicker times at uh, Road America, and uh, after that, I'll, I'll I'll check back with I'll check back with you in a little bit.
Alright everybody, um, just got done finishing up a little bit of a practice session at uh, Road America for tomorrow. Um, it's about midnight now, um, so I'm going to be heading on off to sleep, and uh, tomorrow's going to be a really fun day. Um, cannot wait to, to be meeting up with uh, um, Robbie and David tomorrow. Um, also going to be seeing quite a few other people, so... It's going to be a very fun day at the Motorsport Straight Show tomorrow. But anyway, guys, I'm heading off to sleep, so I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, guys, good morning, everybody. It is, um, it's, it's almost 8 a.m. right now, and uh, we are about to head on the road to Oaks, Pennsylvania for the Motorsports Race Car and Trade Show. Um, got my Johnson swag on today because, uh, Sherry's going to, Sherry's all going to need that, especially, uh, you know, that I gotta get his new ally shirts and all that, but, yeah, um, but yeah, we're heading, yeah, we're heading on out to, uh, heading on out to Oaks, Pennsylvania for the Motorsports Straight Show, gonna be a very exciting day, um, several of you guys wanna, maybe several of you guys wanna meet me there, so, uh, so it's, it's gonna be, it's gonna be a f fun time today, I will tell you that, so, we'll see you guys on the road. It's over there, it's over there. It's the left. Well, you can actually park anywhere, I don't care.
that would have actually made me want to die. <laughs> Jamie McBurry. I hate the one that race. This was for the, this was for the, for the blog. Hey, you only got to put up with him for one more race. Thanks, Suck God. it up, Buttercup. <laughs> I actually, like, hate him. Like, he is just such a c**t. <laughs> you just said that on the stream. You no, know, you just said that on my vlog right there. Yeah. Which, by the way, I didn't. Yeah, oh, I, I don't think. I don't think y'all didn't know. So yeah, I don't think anybody knows who I am. So they land race at twenty. Race at twenty eleven. Uh, with, I, I don't even know what sure it says. Are we throwing up gang signs. <laughs> <laughs> and. Well, and what's and what's yours? Uh, my name's Jack. Brooklyn, Jack with Hunter Racing on Instagram. Give me a follow. <laughs> <laughs> Found tricky. How you doing? What's going on, man? It's um, recording, yeah, re uh, uh, recording a vlog for my channel actually. So uh, yeah, um, wishing you the best of luck on your season. All right, everybody. So now we are sitting here at the stage, waiting on Daryl Waltrip. Also got a Ryan Priest Hero card signed, so uh, that's that's pretty cool. Um, uh, I'm waiting. Not sure what's happening with Robbie and David and those guys, but um, but uh, but uh, but, uh, but uh, we'll see. But um, uh, anyway, gonna get ready for Daryl Walsh. <laughs> now we left the stage. Oh, there he is. It looks like a show car. It's a beautiful piece of work, and uh, I know that Ray Abraham was here, and he loves the modified. I do too. And I think all of us guys down south. Uh, I know uh, Brian Newman, he loves driving the modifies every now and then. And, uh, I, I never drove one, I just like watching them. Uh, Jimmy Spencer, I got, I've watched him run some races. I didn't hear any booze or anything, so <laughs> But, uh, but it's, it's just been fun to, uh, to see some of these cars and the, and, the, and the guys and the gals up here, some of them, I saw Jimmy Horton here a little bit ago, and I'm sure there's some other old friends in the crowd, but, uh, Really nice to be here today. I brought my old Mercury up here. It's sitting over here on display, my 71 Mercury, and uh, that's that's one of my favorite old cars, and so it's just good to be here. And on a personal note, uh, we want to extend uh, congratulations on your upcoming golden anniversary with the missus. Oh my gosh, yeah, well. Woo! Jimmy and I were just talking about that, and uh, uh, we'll be married 50 years in uh, August. And we got married on a Friday, and uh, we went to Louisville. I lived in Owensboro, Kentucky. We went to Louisville, Kentucky, which is two and a half, three hours from Owensboro. I had $69 and a pretty hot Visa card. <laughs> and uh, when I checked into the hotel, they took my credit card. Uh, they said, we've been looking for this. So I lost my credit card. So now I'm down to $69 and no credit card. And, by the, and, and so there was a race at Salem, Indiana on Sunday. Salem's not too far from Louisville. So I called some friends of mine and I said, uh, if, if I meet you in Salem Sunday, can I drive your car? And they said, sure, we'd love to have you drive the car. So I went to Salem and I didn't have enough money left to get into the pits. So I had to wait for my mom and dad who were coming up from Owensboro to get to the track to pay for my pit pass to get in the pits. And, and, and this would have been a beautiful thing. 
I had it all planned out. French Lake, Indiana is not too far from Salem. That's a beautiful hotel there. And this was a long time ago. So I had this all figured out. If you win this race, you won $1,000. So that's a lot of money. And 25 or 40 or whatever percent of that. And I said, man, I'm winning this race. We leave here after the race. We go on down to French Lake and we just, we just have a great honeymoon celebration. So I'm driving a 57 Chevrolet, number 100 from Owensboro. Last lap, I led, I led a lot of the race. The last lap I'm leading, and a guy named Iggy Katona in a factory Dodge. He'd been on my bumper the whole time, just wearing me out. I was better than a turn, he was better than a straightaway. I was better than a turn, he was better than a straightaway. Last lap, white flag in the air, I can see that $1,000. I can see me and Stevie over in French Lake, Indiana having a big time. I go in the third turn, and I've heard old Iggy every time we go down that back straightaway. And I beat him in the corner, beat him in the corner. This time, last time going in the third turn, I mean, go, bam, into me, went, put me in the pants, kept, and knocked me out of the race, and he won the race, and I didn't. And so there went my $1,000, and there went my honeymoon. And it almost went my marriage. But, <laughs> but we survived, and here we are 50 years later. <laughs> What, a, what an honor. What, what, a, what an honor this is to meet you. This is uh, um, Brand, my name is Brandon. Um, I'm making this as a vlog for my YouTube channel, uh, Jimmy 40 a fan. It's, uh, it's such an honor to, to finally meet you. What are you making? A vlog for a YouTube channel. Oh, really? So, yeah. So, do you, do you do it every day or just... No, I no, I do this. I do this every now and then, but I mostly do race reactions. So uh, every every week yeah. to to your to your broadcast, it means a lot. And I'm also commentating for the core league for uh, for the um, the league with all the YouTubers and such, all the big NASCAR YouTubers. So it's it's really it's really cool. I'm following your footsteps. It means How a lot. How many followers do you have? Uh, over thirteen hundred. Thirteen hundred right now. That's good. Yeah. You probably get a couple more when we uh, show this. Yeah. <laughs> All right, everybody. So, uh, so we're just about to leave now. Um, so, obviously, race. Obviously, Robbie, race day 2011. Uh, obviously, yeah. To the fans, to the fans of my channel, what is it honestly worth it coming? Is it worth the 15 bucks? It's still worth it. You know, there's quite a few people here still. If you want to come get into racing, or if you want to get more knowledge about local racing around here, you, you can definitely come here. But there's a lot of diecast vendors. There's a lot of people around here. You know, so it's still a good show. Yeah, and also I was I also ran I also ran into Ryan Priest for, for some odd reason again. Um, I'll play I'm actually gonna play that little clip uh, right now. It was uh overall I had had a very fun time. It was like it was really nice meeting you again. It was nice meeting you again as well. And uh, I can't wait can't wait to see you again in Pocono see you um, in Pocono, August. Of course. Um, also, make sure weekend. you make sure you go check his channel out, Race Day 2011. Uh, he uploads die he, he uploads diecast. Um, he up, he also got a quite a bit of rusty gear, rusty yeah, wall, Wallace well, gear. Well, this is the Fontana winner, but it's in the wrong box. So yeah, well, I got it for ten bucks. Normally it goes on eBay for like what 70, 80 ish. So it, I got a steal out of that one. Yeah. yeah he also he also got a retro uh, Jeff Jeff Gordon diecast for only ten bucks. Retro De Jeff Gordon diecast supposed to be signed by Ray Abraham, but I'll get him on Carb Day. Yeah. He's also. Uh, I think you aren't. Are you considering like vlogging your time in Indy? Still, well, I'm gonna do or is it or is it just mostly photography? Stuff? Mostly still photography. But, but yeah, make sure you check him. Make sure you check him out on Instagram and all that. But um, anyway, we're officially heading out. Um, once again, it was a. It was a. It's an absolute. It was an absolute pleasure seeing you again. Of course. Um, couldn't get a pick with David. Couldn't get a pick with David Land. I know that sucks, but I have a video clip, so okay. that's. I guess that's all that matters. Good enough.
I got to talk to Ryan Priest and uh, got Daryl Walter to talk to me for about a minute. Um, you'll see that on the vlog once it comes out tomorrow night. But uh, anyway, we're heading on out. So uh, I'll see you guys Peace. on the road. All right, everybody. So we just so I just got back from the motorsports show, and uh, this was re this was really cool. I first got this uh, I first got this Ryan Priest hero card signed by Ryan Priest. You saw that in the in the vlog, and you also saw Daryl Waltrip sign um, sign sign my name there uh, when I got to, when I got to meet him at uh, when I got to meet him at the event, which that was really cool. And uh, that was really cool conversation we had uh, for the minute that I showed you guys with that with that with that clip. That was just special in itself. But um, anyway, I'm gonna fire up the uh, fire up the TV um, because if it could if it could uh, if it can go through, please. I am going on this thing because because tonight because now I am getting ready for the Cardation for the Cardation Cup race uh, number two for Road America. Um, I feel very confident in our race car uh, tonight. Um, we should have a top. We sh I think we we will definitely have a top five finish. Um, Got a new teammate in uh, Fluffy Fluffy uh, Fluffy Racing. If you guys don't know him, he's one of the top NASCAR Heat 3 YouTubers. Um, well, not not YouTubers, but racers in general. Um, so, and it's really cool that I'm getting to uh, that I'm gonna be that I'm teammates with him, and uh, and it's all gonna be one big party tonight. But um, anyway, gonna get ready to do to live stream uh, the Carnation Cup race, and uh, I'll see you guys after that. All right, guys. Well, with that, um, that is officially going to wrap up um, quite possibly one of the best vlogs that I've ever made on this channel. Um, spent time at the motorsports show. Um, got to see David Land, Race Day 2011. A uh, few other faces, a uh, couple from, from the a uh, couple from the Dover Squad. Um, fortunately, I did not get any video of that. Um, but um, I wish I do apologize for that. But um, yeah, it's uh, also got to also got to talk with Daryl Daryl Waltrip there for a moment. That was really cool. Um, so I'm sorry I didn't record anything actually. As I'm recording this right now, it's like it's three in the afternoon the next day. Literally, like once I got back from the event, I pretty much just passed out. I ju I just basically fell asleep and <laughs> I sure got I sure got quite a bit of sleep last night. No doubt about it. But uh. Yeah, with that, that is going to wrap it up for this first ever GB48 vlog of 2019. I hope you guys all enjoyed it as much as I did enjoy making it for you guys. Um, and I'm also, and also, if you also did enjoy it, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, join the GB48 revolution today, and also share this video. Also share this, share this video to to others who who may have not attended the show and you know who would like to you know you could you could show them this video and maybe they'll be greatly interested in coming next year it's absolutely worth the 15 bucks even if it is for just one day you can go for three days but it was absolutely worth it it was absolutely worth it for 15 dollars um on uh saturday so notes so yeah it's uh it was a really, really, really great experience, and I already cannot wait to head back next year. But um, anyway, also I didn't update about the Cardation Cup thing. Um, uh, I ended up finishing in ninth. Um, did have a top five. I did have a top five going for me, uh, but unfortunately got wrecked on one of the restarts and uh, had to rally my way back up to ninth. So uh, at least it's a, at least it's a top ten. So you know what? I'll take that. But anyway, guys. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all on the next video, and remember, always stay humble and kind.